WENY News at 5.30. As you've seen all those signs that we did indeed get justice for Kelly Clayton. That was Special District Attorney Whedon Wetmore moments after a Steuben County jury found Thomas Clayton guilty of hiring Michael Beard to kill Clayton's wife, Kelly. After six weeks, more than 75 witnesses and 500 pieces of evidence, the jury began deliberating yesterday around 10.30 a.m. Good evening, I'm Renata Steele. And I'm Nick Quattrini. Within minutes of deliberating this morning, the jury had a verdict. They found Thomas Clayton guilty on all counts. WENY's Logan Wilson is live at the Steuben County Courthouse with the latest. Nick and Renata, after a seven week trial, family and friends of Kelly Stage Clayton can finally breathe a sigh of relief, along with the prosecution and law enforcement officials who spent more than a year investigating this case. I've never seen a case like this. We've never seen a case that consumed all our time, uh, our, our leisure time if we had any. And uh, I, I guess the words that will express is tremendous relief after all that work. Uh, Thank goodness we got the right result. After 75 witnesses, 500 pieces of evidence, and a 30-day trial, Thomas Clayton's fate boiled down to just six hours of deliberation. Twelve of his peers found him guilty of first and second degree murder. Kelly Stage Clayton was brutally murdered by Michael Beard in a murder-for-hire case in the Clayton's Caton home on September 29, 2015. Special District Attorney Whedon Wetmore said this conviction wouldn't have been possible without the teamwork of Southern Tier Police Agencies. All agencies that were involved worked as collaboratively as possible as a team, and I'm so proud of our agency, the State Police, Chemung County Sheriff's Office, and all agencies that helped in this. Both Clayton and Beard now sit behind bars in the Steben County Jail while they await sentencing. But Clayton's defense attorney, Ray Schlotter, said his client is innocent and he plans to appeal the conviction. It's not over. Uh, this is, Mr. Clayton is, is adamant. Uh, he is not guilty of these offenses. He did not kill his wife. He didn't hire anybody to kill his wife. After the conviction, Clayton was immediately taken into custody. Now he'll remain behind bars until his sentencing, which is scheduled for the end of April. Now coming up on WNY News at 6, hear reaction from Kelly's family on today's verdict. But for now, reporting live from the Steben County Courthouse, Logan Wilson, WNY News. In the community, like she said, it's been so behind Unbelievable. us. Unbelievable. Everything. Thank you. Thank you. I think I believe justice was done here today. That was Kelly Clayton's family moments after a Steuben County jury found Thomas Clayton guilty of hiring Michael Beard to kill Clayton's wife, Kelly. After six weeks, more than 75 witnesses and 500 pieces of evidence, the jury started deliberating yesterday around 1030 a.m. Good evening, I'm Renata Steele. And I'm Nick Quaterni. And within minutes of deliberating this morning, the jury had a verdict. They found Thomas Clayton guilty on all counts. WMI's Logan Wilson is live at the Steuben County Courthouse with more reaction from Kelly's family. Nick and Renata, after a 30-day trial lasting nearly seven weeks, family and friends of Kelly Stage Clayton can finally breathe a sigh of relief as both Michael Beard and Thomas Clayton now sit behind bars. I told my sister from the night she was murdered that we would not stop fighting for her. We would not stop fighting for justice for her. She was beautiful, bright, and she is still bright. The sun is out right now, and she is here, and she will always be with Charlie and Cullen. Kelly Stage Clayton was brutally murdered by Michael Beard in a murder for hire case in the Clayton's Clayton home on September 29th, 2015. Now her husband, Thomas Clayton, sits behind bars convicted of orchestrating her death. I would like to thank the community. I would like to thank Whedon Wetmore, Susan, every investigator. I mean, this case has taken Thousands. thousands and thousands of hours, manpower. Thomas Clayton's fate boiled down to just six hours of deliberation as 12 of his peers found him guilty on first and second degree murder. Justice for my daughter. 
it's just it's just been you know it's been a long haul and and i am sorry for his family i am i'm oh, sorry yeah. for all of us no one won no one won in this no one did both Clayton and Beard now sit behind bars in the Staben County Jail while they await sentencing. Special District Attorney Whedon Wetmore says he'll most likely ask the judge for the max. Both men are facing 25 years to life in prison without the possibility of parole. Now Michael Beard is set to be sentenced on Monday. Thomas Clayton's sentencing is scheduled for the end of April. Reporting live from the Steben County Courthouse, Logan Wilson, WENY News.